Bupanema started with Kenneth inviting Rodrigo to Denmark, saying, I met this amazing saxophone singer, multi-instrumentalist, uh, and he invited him to Copenhagen and asked me and Schultz if he wanted to be involved in recording some songs. Uh, I get involved with Copenhagen uh, when Kenneth, he contacted me because uh, he had met this um, great Brazilian guy, he has just been there and he wanted me to play some chords on this uh, new things and then we uh, we just started jamming and uh, Rodrigo came over here and you know we found out that maybe we should make an album in one week, you know, we only had one week to do this album here. The Copanema project actually started when I was uh, asked by the Danish council to go on a three uh, week tour in Brazil and they set up meetings with different musicians and uh, one of the meetings was a barbecue for this guy called Rodrigo Shah. So I became involved in Copanema in Brazil when I met Kenneth Baker. He went to my house and then we, we met each other and we listened music and then we saw that we have a lot of things in common about music, about lifestyle. And uh, after all the guests has left uh, his apartment, he asked me because we felt really natural and uh, you know there was a great communication right from the beginning. And he he said to me that you know did did you bring any demos or did you have anything with you? And I had luckily I had one demo which was 12 minutes, and it was just two chords, and uh, wasn't really finished. It was a dubstep track which was unusual for me and uh, we put it in his computer and I, I, I was sitting, I think it was in his living room and I said, I respect and love the way you play saxophone uh, because I've been listening to quite a few of his tracks before I met him and then he, um, he just played the saxophone solo for nine minutes, it was a one take and I absolutely loved it. And after we did this, then I said to him, you know what, we should have some, uh, like a hook, uh, um, a singing hook. And I said, we should have something like Pep Metheny. Yeah, it's like this, man. It's like this all We're the time. here all the time do, uh, doing whatever they want. But it's hard to be a superstar. We're happy. We're happy. We're happy. We're happy.